Yeah, so the second date uh, surprised Hannah by bringing her here. And uh, we took the aeroplane up over York and uh, showed a York Minster and the various sites. She had to go at flying the plane and, and landed and went out, went out for dinner afterwards. most infectious smile. She's always thinking about everyone else except her. If, she, if everybody else is happy then, then she's having a good time. And we just laugh so much. Whatever adventure we're on, we just we just don't stop giggling. So the engagement was a weekend away. I remember as well trying to explain to Hannah that we were just going for a casual walk. We, we took a walk through the beautiful grounds and I remember trying to get the lighting just right. So I was eager to try and make sure we timed it just right and I'm squeezing her hand and trying to slow us down because I've realized I wanted it to be a little bit darker or maybe not too dark. And she, she, she recalled me squeezing her hand and saying, are you, are you all right? You seem very nervous. What's up? No, no, I'm fine. We walked through the gardens. over these stepping stones onto this little island and she got these big heels on, this beautiful dress and these great big heels and I'm thinking how is she going to get across the stepping stones in these heels but I, I couldn't give it away. I'd set up as we walked around the corner, beautiful picnic with, with champagne and flowers and I made the proposal there. And I just burst into tears. <laughs> We're looking forward to the biggest day of our life. We are meticulously planning every single last detail. We don't want it to come too soon because we're looking forward to it so much, yet we can't wait for it to, to be just around the corner. <laughs>